Hey guys, it's me, Mr. 250, and welcome back to Umineko. So, I just recently restarted my computer pretty... about a day after that stream happened. Totally forgot that I think your, uh, your save data is, like, tied to some file probably in, like, my documents or something. I forgot, because I remember this happened before. Luckily, we're right pretty much at the end of the game. All we had to do left was the tea party and stuff. So, that's not as bad this time as it was last time for me that this happened. That does mean I'm going to have to unlock episode 7, I believe, if I want to access the tea party. And it's going to change whatever image appears in the background. Hopefully that's not an issue. But I figured we'd all go along for the ride. Oh, yeah, that's not really a problem at all. That's an image we're used to. Alright, so, episode 6 Tea Party, here we go. I've been told this one isn't too long, so we might be able to do it in one sitting if it's, like, not too long that long. Vito took Battler's hand and put a ring with the seal of the one winged eagle on his finger. いいのか。両親はすでにあなたです。ですからこの指輪はバトラさんのものです。本当にいいのか。これは。お前が生み出した世界。そしてもう。はい。あなたと一緒になりたくて。生み出したものがたり。だから、もうこの世界の目的は果たされました。だからこれからは、あなたが紡いでください。私とあなたの、これからの物語を。天じゃ、か。<笑><笑> 両者の面倒くさい仕事を押し付けるだけよ。She's really nailing that Beto thing pretty well. 夫人は威張るだけでいいから、実に気楽なことだ。わらわは日々を遊んで、そなたが新しい物語を書くのを待てばいい。そして、新しい物語の旅に、そなたのためにどんな役でもこなそうぞ。凶悪な魔女でも。Peter's hand relinquished the ring of the territory lord from Battler. She received a silver ring with a crest that could only be worn by the wife of the territory lord. Then they exchanged their rings, and their wedding was complete. Well, look at you go, battler. Didn't want to waste that whole wedding. Since everyone is here and all. Then the pair turned around, faced the packed crowds of guests, and raised their rings high. A thunderous applause rang out for them. At Battler's nod, Peter read the name of the first guest to be recognized. Kano, Mai. A girl goat pushed her way through the crowd, took off her mask, and yelled. A cloud of gold butterflies gathered before Battler and Beto, and took the form of Cannon, kneeling in front of these two nobles. Cannon had already died and vanished. However, all of the dead revive in the Golden Land. 
かもここにそなたは囚われの身となっていた我が夫の you know, that was the thing that always bothered me every time they reference you know the everyone revives in the golden land is it always came out super cultish like you know don't worry we'll all revive in the golden land <laughs> you know that kind of feeling So it always put me off every time somebody said that. Usually the servants. But sometimes、uh, we get it from like Maria and stuff. ありがたき幸せカノくんヨシオくんヨシオくんジェスカ raced forward and land sobbing in Cannon's chest Cannon patted her head gently and held her カグとして使えるんじゃないぜ人間として使えるんだぜそこの意味理解してるよなはい。After looking at Jessica sobbing, he looked at Battler again and nodded forcefully. そしてもう一つ。後ろ宮ジョージ、並びにシャノン、前へ。George and Shannon were the next to be called. Perhaps they already readied themselves. They walked forward boldly and kneeled. Ushiromiya, George, Kokoni. Shannon, Kokoni. Sonata Rawa, Zepar to Furu Furu no Siren, O Migo to Saigo Made Taenuita. Sono Migo to Na Kosek to Aizo, Ketsui to Koketsawa, Mohan to Ste Kono Uenak. ありがたき幸せ。本証明書は何人たりとも異議申し立てすることはかなわない。叙勲者親族一同は心して祝福せよ。つうわけだ。しがらみは一切なしで。どうか二人に米粒の雨をぶつけて祝福してやってくれよっおめでとうご両人 When the territory lord clapped his hand in celebration, it spread throughout the entire cathedral. Then a group of goats from the front line of the crowd took their masks off one by one. いいことあんまりしょっぱいお味噌汁作ったら許さないんだからねそれからジョージは少し太りやすいから砂糖を控えめに。Good job, Territory Lord. You've got her to stop freaking out about everything. ジョージ、男は結婚したらな、親より嫁を大切にせなあかん。母さんが何を言ってもな、シャモンちゃんをしっかり守るんやで。ああ、当然さ。ジョージさん。ジョ,ジョージはねきっちり7時間寝ないとダメなのよ夜更かしさせたら許さないんだからね背中を流すのも耳の掃除も妻の仕事なのよそそうだったんですか<笑>私としたことがし仕事内容は家によるレダルフさん妻を大事にしてるしてるじゃねえかなんでそこを疑うんだよお幸せにねご両人結婚はゴールじゃないわむしろスタートよぼくたちも負けてられないですね<笑>ぜ絶対負けねえぜちくしょう
all of the Ushirimiya family, all of the servants, and all of the spirits and demons that were attending, celebrated the honorees with an even greater applause. That really is a miracle if you can get the parents to agree on the on the wedding with the servant thing. ひとつは黄金鏡のすべての黄金。ひとつはすべての死者の魂を蘇らす。ひとつは失った愛すらも蘇らす。ひとつは魔女を永遠に眠りにつかせん。奴らかに眠れ。我が最愛の魔女ベ
but a new message bottle which had drifted here once more from Rokinjima of 12 years period previous to tell her of one single truth and it seemed as though she had found her own interpretation of the truth she had thought the tale was trying to tell of course that was only one truth and it did not mean the end of her journey however maybe it can be viewed this way this wasn't sufficient to fill the 12-year gap in her heart. However, right now, just enjoying the feeling along with the bitter coffee Hachijo had made was enough. なんだ。素直にそういうことも言えるじゃない。最初からそういう口調で喋ってれば、もっとファンも増えるんじゃない。あなたという素晴らしい読者を I get the feeling that I've spent a really, really long time here. It feels as though I've spent a major fraction of my life here. Though it should feel uncomfortable sitting here on a sofa in someone else's house. For some strange reason, it feels as familiar as my own home. However, the clock shows that it's only been about two or three hours since I met her. My sense of time feels very strange. He said he was going to make a scheduled report to Okonagi-san, didn't he? Even though he was told that he could use the phone here, he declined and went to look for a public phone somewhere. Something about how he didn't want to risk being bugged. He's a moron, so I'll let him do what he wants. Do その金をあなたに払ったら、また来て私の新しい原稿を読んで感想を聞かせてくれますか札束払ってまで私みたいな可愛くない女に原稿を読んでほしいんですかあ、don't さがすために私たちは物語を紡ぎ世に放っているのです。褒めすぎだわ。私は読書に感情移入しすぎるタイプなだけよ。この短くない時間を割いてくれたお礼にいつかきっとあなたの物語を書きましょう。またあんたの義
あなたの真実にたどり着けますようにありがとうもしあなたの真実にたどり着けたならあなたの真実もいつか物語にしてみてくださいあんたらの魔女仲間になれとどうかしら文字書くの苦手だし良き読者が良き執筆者とは限らないわよいやいや全く私も人の本は全く読めませんしやれやれじゃあこれであなたとはこれで二度と会わないだろうけれどいつかどこかで別のあなたにまた会える幸運を祈っていますお最後に一つだけ聞いてもいいどうぞ物語の中に登場したフェザリーヌって魔女あれはあんたよね語るのもおこがましいですがそのつもりですこういう質問もおかしいんだけどそのあんたがフェザリーヌなのフェザリーヌがあんたなのさて何の話やら This mysterious woman had been mysterious to the last. In this way, the day of which I have no memories ended. In the next day, I would take a boat to Nijima. I'll probably never meet her again. However, that just means that I won't meet her, so the other me's might meet her somewhere down the road. Just as I have reached several truths, they must also want to reach the truth. So long, Featherine. If you ever write a better story, please call me again. If I'm free, I might drop by. Your stories suck. <laughs> The package is in the bag. The person on the other end of the line was Okonagi. Okonagi was also one who tended to move from place to place, so it hadn't been easy to catch him even on the phone. もちろん。旦那もよくこんなもんが国内で手配できるもんだ。Behind a Makusa was the rental car that they had borrowed under a, used, a false name, inside of which was now a black golf bag. Unfortunately, there would be no golfing today. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 that? I heard about that. Ebasu. <laughs> 
なきゃと俺たちは結束していくことで合意してんだ見越しは大事だが少々よろしくない世界平和のためにもな流れ次第ってことですぜスマデラの黒服がマシな自由の落ち方をしてくれりゃいいんだな<笑>んなんです旦那まさかほんの数日の逃避行でエンジちゃんとできちまったわけじゃねえだろうな<笑>あんな乳臭い小娘に<笑>こう冗談をいや俺は別にいいんだぜお前もようやく女にちょっかいを出すくらいには吹っ切れたってことじゃねえか世界の半分は女なんだぜ一人や二人でうじうじしてたら身が持たねえぜふん<笑>おっと噂すりゃなんとやらだお嬢が来ましたそんじゃこれで新島の宿に着いたら連絡しますぜそれじゃエンジー、ウィズ・ワーキング・ダウン・ザ・ストリート。ウィズ・シェフ・トゥ・ドゥ・ダウ・ウィズ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・ドゥ・面白かった収穫はそれだけよ<笑>そいつはクールだ After Marcus opened the passenger side door Angie got in the car Marcus quickly went around to the driver's seat じゃあ港へ向かいます旦那の情報じゃスマドラ家が網を張ってるらしいですぜそれに引っかかるようなら私の運もその程度引っかからないなら六軒島は私を待ってるわ任せましょう運に運かどうするか決めかねている時あるいはどうでもいい時コイントスのように運命に身を任すのも悪いことじゃないわへへ<笑>なら俺もそいつに任せてみますかね嫌いじゃねえやそういうのボディーガードが運任せとか言い出したわ最悪旦那との電話のせいですっかりオチを読み損ねちゃったあのあとどうなったんですかい聞かせてくださいよ嫌よ教えないわそりゃ残念 The car dashed through the hilly town This car will not return to Hachijo's house for all eternity. However, Angie didn't get sentimental about it. For now, she just wanted to silently consider the new message bottle that the current endless witch, Hachijo Toya, had given her. In the rearview mirror, the town where a witch lived faded off into the distance. However, that scene wasn't reflected in Angie's eyes. You know, there was something that I was thinking about. I actually thought about it for, I want to say, a good 20 minutes today. The whole. When Beto when asked the.、Uh, what was it? When she asked the.、Uh, I can't remember what they're called as a group, but.、Uh, but Zephyr and Furfur. When she asked them、uh, why, why they needed a miracle for love, and you know, can't you just love each other? Isn't that enough? And then they brought up the point that, you know, there's, there's are actually circumstances where just love enough isn't enough. And then they compared it to, you know, like, you know, sibling relationships and parent and child, that kind of stuff. Like, that stuff doesn't work. And so I was thinking about that because. 
I was wondering the same thing, you know, why why did they need this miracle? And they were saying because, you know, this is the kind of love that just doesn't work. And that, and that the miracle was the only way that that kind of thing was going to work for them. And I'm assuming that's uh, related to how they were... Uh, To how, how they were furniture. That'd be my guess. And we've got episode 6 of the Tea Party for those who are not human. But that's going to be for next time. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully this isn't a really, really short, like, 5 minute section. If it is, I might just make a separate video. Um, if you guys let me know in the comments. If it's a longer one, we'll just do it like normal. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for some more Umineko. Oh, I should also add, um, along with restarting the computer, I had to re-download all my old audio and video recording stuff. So, it's not so much here because I'm going to be editing the audio, but for the streams, uh, you will probably need to let me know yet again if the audio is too loud or too quiet or whatever because everything is like set back to default again. So keep that in mind. Thanks for watching.